the kids come first. And if they had their Easter clothes, we could wear the same thing for three years. Yeah. Because they had theirs first. They had theirs first. Well, you know, the, you know, also the bottom line is we, we had a vision. And see, that vision was to, to make this family strong, make this family have love for each other, not to have backbiting and everything, but to, to, to love each other, you know, with the love of God. And we've seen that happen in you all. In mm -hmm. you all. That's right. That's, that's, that's the bottom line. That's mm -hmm. the bottom line. Yeah. But the struggle is for all of us. That's if, right. If, if you don't have that vision, then you're gonna, you, uh -huh. your struggle is going to get you. Uh -huh. But if you got that vision, don't worry about the struggle. Yeah. That's right, because you're going to get to the other side. Gonna get to the other that's side. right. Well, thank thank y'all for this, this portion with uh, some of our family being live. Mm -hmm. We live, baby. We live. Well, um, we have Cheryl, Moni, Donald, BJ, and Lila live. I'm going to have to say bye to y'all because my phone battery is low. Uh, so y'all want to say bye to Bummer and Papa for now? Bye. Bye, y'all. So we love y'all. We love y'all. Looking forward to seeing you. Yes. And DJ. And, and I'm going to come have a hamburger and a hot dog with DJ because I like the way he cooked. <laughs> <laughs> it gets real hot, eh? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Bye bye. Bye bye, baby. Bye, -bye. bye Cheryl. Bye, Donnie. Love you. Bye. All right, bye, y'all. All right, Molo. Mahalash. <laughs> okay. Love you. Love you. All right. Bye bye. You got a nickname already? Yeah, we got a couple. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. yeah. Man, this um, is good, man. You brought us all the way back, bro. Oh man, it, it, and it's it's uh, yeah, you know, there was a there were a few more questions. Jamila asked a question. Uh, uh -huh. Well, one of those questions is uh, what are the five most? And I think y'all answered a lot of it, but I'm a, I'm gonna ask, mm -hmm. what are the five most? Uh, what are the five most? important qualities or things they believe is, that y'all believe is necessary to make a lasting marriage? All right. Uh, number one is truthfulness. Got to mm -hmm. be true to each other. That's right. Another one, the other one is, I think, is they have to be able to forgive each other. Truthfulness, forgive each other. Mm -hmm. Anything else? Truthfulness. Okay. Now, all of that truthfulness to build relationships on. Truthfulness and staying real close to, to each other. Not always agreeing, but coming t t to that place where you come together and you know it, like you know it, you was called mm -hmm. by God together. Yeah. So when you get discouraged, you think about who brought you together. Yeah. God did, and his word is gonna keep you together. Mm -hmm. When you give in to his word, and you 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 trust in God, but you also stay tightly with God, walking down the path of God, keeping God in your marriage, is knowing that when you take those vows and being uh, together, and you take the vows, you're taking a vow unto God. Not 
just for the pretty ceremony, uh, but your vow is to God. Because when the road get bumpy, mm -hmm. you got to realize that you got to keep going in, in God and asking Him to guide you over those bumps mm -hmm. and knowing that you'll get together on, a, 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 on the other side. You're going to the other side. Yeah. You, you won't stop mm -hmm. in discouragement. Mm -hmm. When discouragement comes, mm -hmm. you would allow yourself, just like David said, encourage yourself in the Lord and keep going. Keep on going. Mm -hmm. And knowing that you're called together by God and not by the prettiness of the wedding, and weddings are pretty. Mm -hmm. Every wedding that I go to, it gives you that warm feeling mm -hmm. because there's two people coming together, mm -hmm. and they coming together united in a holy matrimony. Mm -hmm. One other thing is uh, also is traditionally, uh, Traditionally, we've been led wrong in what marriage really is about, especially in the area of the manhood. Uh, traditionally, man has said that man is the boss over the, the house or the boss over the wife. Mm -hmm. And that's not really true because the Bible says what God is joined together let no man put a son in that son. man and woman has become one place. Yes. So it's nobody is the boss per se. Mm -hmm. uh, but if man has God as his head, or Christ as his head, then he's going to treat the woman according to what God has done for us, that he gave his life mm -hmm. for us, and a man gives his life for his wife. Yeah. So, her flesh is my flesh. Mm -hmm. My flesh is her flesh. Yeah. Mm -hmm. if, you, if you get to see that, marriage is Like your last. daddy sings all the time, bone of my bones, flesh. Flesh of my flesh. Mm -hmm. My flesh. We all one. Mm -hmm. We all one. We all one. That's right. I, um, <laughs> you know, uh, I think about just when, uh, like when you start thinking about things like it's like it's tick for tack. Mm -hmm. I did this, so you got to do this. Mm -hmm. That's mm -hmm. really not love, huh? You mm -hmm. know, it's uh, in other words, let's say yesterday, today. Mm -hmm. Now we, you know, I could go back, way back, and talk about a lot of things. Mm -hmm. But the grandmother, I know she was going for the, to have the pilot thing looked at, you know. What they call it, the guest? Guest drunk. Yeah. And so my mind was to prepare for her when she came back home. Mm -hmm. that, that was my mind. Mm -hmm. You know, and that's, I was going to make sure she had what she needed when she came back home. And so that's love. Mm -hmm. You know, you, you can't get nothing out of that but love. Mm -hmm. uh, let's say if I hadn't did that, it still wasn't nothing wrong. Yeah. See what I'm saying? But love produces mm -hmm. things. Mm -hmm. When you love, you're going to produce. Mm -hmm. that. And, and that takes time and walking together and growing together. It don't just just happens it takes time aligning each other mm -hmm. and walking together mm -hmm. and it will happen it, it 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 happens things things don't change because a person say well you you got to do this you got to do that but when you put the got to 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 but when I, I've learned over the years that it's a, just like a train wheel, 
it rotates. Mm -hmm. it, 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 it keeps going and mm -hmm. as you come across these grounds, you tackle the ground and you go to the other hurdle. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. thing is too. You but you're gonna be victorious as you stick with it. Stick with it. That's yeah. right. Another thing is you do things together. Mm-hmm. You know, I mean, just a normal thing, do mm -hmm. it together. They we had go people. Go to the store together. Oh. Mm -hmm. You want to say something? Mm -hmm. You know, we grocery together. Mm -hmm. uh, we shop together. If you even miss it, make it stay in there too long. <laughs> the Farron is trained to that. I used to keep them in, in handcuffs. Yeah. <laughs> y'all, y'all, yeah, y'all taught us so much. <laughs> <laughs> But, but marriage is designed for man. Now, I'm not saying just a man, but it's, it's especially for the man because you know the Adam and Eve story. Mm -hmm. God said, it's not good that man should be alone. And he took so that rib. He, he gave him the woman. Mm -hmm. So that's, that's important, you know. Some men want to just play the field, you know. But marriage is strength. Uh, marriage is beautiful. And uh, there's no, uh, there's no negative in marriage. The Bible said the bed of the marriage is undefiled. So it's, you know, it's no, it's just nothing, it's just nothing in there you can throw in there that's bad. It's good. It's yeah. All good. It's all good. What you see? It's all good. And, <laughs> and, and, and he called, he, 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 he took that rib from Adam and put it in Eve, made Eve. To be what? A help me to Adam, not to walk behind him, but to walk with him. And and like he said, to give, he, he gives the strength, the working by the sweat of his brow mm -hmm. to provide. See, a man is made different from a woman. His job is to work by the sweat of his brow. That's if if he have a job to do so. It, in these days, they got desk jobs and with your education. He's a provider. So a man thinks about providing and dollar signs. Dollar signs that's on the uh, uh, the counter, the accounting bills and things, what they got to pay and what he has to earn. Mm -hmm. Where a lady is domestic and a man sees things like. Say, for instance, your grandpa, sometime at night, I might hear a sound, sound like it's coming from the front door. And I said, so I mean, did you hear that? No, I don't hear nothing. Uh, but a lady, if she thinks she hears a sound, she going to get up because her in intuition is out. God put that there. God put in the man to be the provider. But that doesn't say that a woman don't have to have a job to help. Because she's called to be the help meet. And that comes under the, the title of providing. Providing for the home seeing that the home is kept 
in the children is disciplined and uh, uh, things are provided in the home. And w when it, it comes together, it's like unity. Your grandpa was a fantastic provider. He's a good husband. And uh, well, sometimes, sometimes we we have to have a a, a, a discussion, mm -hmm. uh, and we discuss, and all marriages do discuss. No, it's called it's called a loud fellowship. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Loud fellowship. That, that ends in a <laughs> love you, <old> boy. Love <laughs> you. <laughs> and love that's you. that's gonna be, but it's the idea of coming together, mm -hmm. and that's good. how you keep on going. Right. And yeah. that's all I have to say. That's that's from from our experiencing. Mm -hmm. 64 years. We can only speak of what we can But we encourage experience. you and Monique. Wow. Y'all right. encourage God put you together. Oh, you, yeah. It's going to be right. That's right. Well, we are, uh, all of us, all of us can look to y'all. So I didn't even realize tomorrow was y'all anniversary. I just came down tonight because mm -hmm. mm -hmm. it was just time for yeah. it. Mm -hmm. But God worked it out. So uh -huh. uh, uh -huh. we've got a got about a minute left. Right. Y'all want to wrap up with? Uh, uh, Y'all want to say anything else, or y'all want to? Well, what what I like to say is that what I see here today with you bringing forth is that I I see this family has grown. To love each other Amen. without a doubt, mm -hmm. and that's my, that's a blessing and that's to me. The and, best. It, and I hope for all the grandchildren and all of those who, you know, husbands and wives do the same mm -hmm. with their family. Mm -hmm. Stay with your family, build mm -hmm. your family, and it's gonna put, it's gonna work out. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Don't don't run when it gets rough. Mm. And it get tough. Mm -hmm. Stay in there with God's guidance. Love y'all. Love you too. Right. Love we too. love y'all. <laughs>